very good morning to every single person that are currently watching this video right here, right now. My name is Akram Noor and you're in my channel, Talk Stay. Thank you for tuning in. We are going to talk about critical review on Article Journal. For those who are not familiar with my channel, when I do critical review, I would normally segmentize my review into a fraction of division. We're going to start off with introduction, content, and then conclusion. Make sure to click like and subscribe button down below to support me to make more of this kind of video in the future. Now, all this out of the way, let's get started. Straight up to introduction of the article. The article title is Special Studies in Management of Construction Project Risk, Risk Concept, Plan Building, Risk Quantitative and Qualitative Analysis, Risk Response Strategies. And the author of the article is Ahmed Muhammad Cash, Ibrahim Ma'aruf, and Yusori Amani. This article was written in 2018, published in Alexandria Engineering Journal, Alexandria University. The theme keyword is project management, risk and concept. That is the theme of this article. Let's continue with the content of the article. The summary of the article. This article indicates the role of project management in guaranteeing the success of distinct major actors, sectors such as information technology, trading, business and engineering discipline. The authors acknowledge that the current ambience of today's business is no longer the same. The movement pace is getting faster, forcing the business owner to be attentive to any intrinsic or prospective risk, as well as being skillful in mastering the controlling, leading, planning and scheduling techniques. In short, this, re this research outlines several problem statements which are the definition of risk, the sources of risk, the approach of diagnosis and strategies used to diminish the defeat the deviation gap of desired outcome. It also demonstrates that only 30% of business organizations execute a risk analysis. As for my critic perspective, all of this risk management plan can be applied to tackle risk in first phase such as cost estimation, suppliers, sources and scheduling. The risk management plan that is being Proposed for first phase is methodology, roles and responsibilities, budgeting and scheduling, and also timing. Move on to the second phase, which is the planning and design stage. The risk management plan that can be applied are the risk categories and risk identification onto the following risks. Controlling, independent, legislation and priorities. Furthermore, the risk management plan that can be executed for the third phase, the phase of construction, are scoring, tracing, risk identifications, and risk categories. It is to avoid the risk within technical aspects, general systems, quality, and requirements. As for the fourth phase, the author have listed out several risks that can be associated with the process of operation, which are marketing, customers, finance and actions. The proposed risk management plan to eliminate or reduce the extent of this risk are formats and templates, scoring and risk categories. As for methodology of risk analysis, risk quantitative and qualitative analysis. Risk qualitative analysis is measuring a degree of impact towards project's objective using the size and breadth of the impact potential risk. The method depends on some computational and visual tools. It consists of matrices of arrangement of probability and consequence, also known as probability impact risk rating matrix. Risk quantitative analysis is calculation of impact by using monetary value or other numerical value. This method shall be focusing on several types of data collection methods. Firstly, the risk analysis will interview 
the stakeholder, beneficiaries, and specialists of the construction project. Secondly, the risk analyst will most likely to use decision tree. Each point will resemble the alternatives and strategies while normal cases points resemble the external situation that might happen. This branching of decision tree will navigate the analyst on the right decision for the investment or project initiation. Finally, the method is a software called Monte Carlo Simulation. This computer software helps in giving prediction on the result that may produce good performance output and eliminate unwanted wastage of resources. life cycle because risk will always be present throughout the journey of building life cycle. <music> 